Ladies and gentlemen, Tasha. From the moment Tasha stepped onto the competition, she was seen as an underdog, someone who didn't have a caliber such as herself. But immediately when the camera clicked for her first photo shoot, the judges could not believe it. And she was off and running. Her talent was rising and rising from week two all the way into week three. Tasha was unstoppable. She was a force of nature, inspiring millions around the world. Tasha has really given everything she has to this competition, sacrificed a lot to get to where she is today. Though no matter her assignment, Tasha could rise to the occasion every time, delivering something amazing and getting her first win for the vampire photo shoot was like a breath of fresh air. Tasha was no longer seen as someone who just possessed talent. She knew how to use her talent respectfully. Tasha managed to go, but when she had a misfall in the, in the partner challenge, Tasha picked herself right back up and hit the ground running the week after. Scoring an incredible win at the fashion ball, people could not believe the amount of talent this Afrolicious diva could possess. Getting another week, right, getting another win in a row. Being the first model in the competition to ever get three wins and make it to the top three. Tasha was the queen of prom, giving it all she had. But now it comes the time. Does Tasha really can... Can Tasha really fit a crown on top of her afro? Well, we feel that she has made it so far in this competition, from the very beginning to the bitter end. Will Tasha get a crown? You'll have to just find out. <laughs>